little gloomy here in the Mile High City today, but we are playing baseball. Two games, in fact, both in the seven inning variety. Two to the count. Swing and a miss, and Vega is driven in, which leads the team in both of those categories. That one in. Swing and a miss. I'm just one hit. And swing and a miss. And another K for Vega. Checo looks in. Left side of the field is going to fall in for the base hit. This is going to be extras. Thurston heading over to third, and they're going to wave him home. Ekman, the second double in as many at bats here, and that drives in Jake Thurston all the way from first base. Roadrunners take a 1 0 lead. Helped him out with the home run yesterday. And this one into left field with the base hit. And they're going to send in Ekman. He's going to get there easily. Donaldson's going to head over to second on the throw. And that ball gets sent into the center field, and he's going to end up over at third on the error. So Roadrunners now up two to nothing. Donaldson with the RBI double. Ellis over at first. This sent to left field, hit well. Donaldson, and that is over the fence. The first hit allowed in the game is a two-run shot that ties this game up. For his first hit of the series. Sends this one into right field. That is cranked. And that one leaves the park, and that'll be the first hit of the series. And it's a round tripper for Cale O'Donnell, hitting his fourth long ball of the season, and it gives MSU Denver the 3 2 lead. Still looking for his first hit, first hit today. Tully, he'll get over to third. Can he get it over at first in time for the double play? Vega comes up with the complete game win over Highlands here, 3 to 2 for game two between MSU Denver and New Mexico Highlands. First pitch swinging. Tully's going to go to second. Nice pick off the ground. Can he get in time at first? They do. Fantastic defense here by the Roadrunners. I'm scored before yesterday where he went one for three. And this one a dribbler. This will probably get the run home. Thurston to first gets the out. But McCarty does come up with the ground out RBI to put Highlands up one to nothing. Runners on the corners. This one's sent into center field. It looks like it's going to drop in for the base hit. And that'll score the second run of this inning for New Mexico Highlands. Salati with the 3-2 count. Both runners going right field, and that's going to fall in. And that'll at least score two. It's going to the far edge of the corner. And Salati might end up on third with the triple. The run comes in. The two runs come in, and they get him out at third base. Salati comes up with the two-run double to make it four to nothing. One of those coming on the Donaldson. This one goes to right center field. He hit that one a long way. Will it exit the park? It will. The two-run shot by Cale O'Donnell cuts this lead in half by New Mexico Highlands. O'Donnell, his second long ball of the day. Goes to right field, and it's going to fall for a base hit, and they're going to send Ortiz. And it's not even going to be close, and the Roadrunners come up. With a run here in the bottom of the fifth inning, Ekman with the RBI single. It is now 4-3 to three Highlands. 1-0 count with one down. Sends us to right field. That one hits long and hard. That one's going to go over the fence for the solo home run by Travis Spruill off Bohannon to put Highlands up now 5-3. to three. This one into left center field. That one's going to fall. And it goes over the head of the left fielder, and he's going to take an extra base and take full advantage. First pitch swinging over to left field. and that Oh, and he drops the ball. Two miscues over in left field by Perez. That should have been out number two. Instead, it'll be a single. This one over. Simmons. And they're going to say he's safe. It took him off the bag. And everything going the Roadrunner's way. This season gets underneath this one, heading over to left center field. It's going, going, and it's in there. It falls in. One run comes in. They're going to send the runner from first. Ekman coming in, and it goes through the legs and the win. The Roadrunners win in walk-off fashion. Ekman looks like he might be hurt. He's holding his wrist, but it's Hunter Donaldson who comes up with the game-winning hit. He sends it to left center field. And Brandon can't hold it for New Mexico Highlands. Roadrunners win this game six to five. My goodness, you just got to feel so great for Hunter Donaldson, who lost his grandfather just 
earlier this week. He comes through with a three run home run yesterday and then with the game winning hit today. I don't know, it was just a battle on the two strikes and I tried to get a, the barrel on the ball and you know, good things happened and we had some runners. Uh, Jake Ekman was turning from first base and he's yeah. the reason, yeah, put it all together. Did you see it coming, the couple of miscues in left field, the shortstop, it just seemed like it was coming your way. Well, yeah. <laughs> Happens. It's awesome. I mean, we're putting it all together, and it's just that's the best feeling I've ever seen. Everyone getting nuts in the dugout. I love it. It's awesome. Well, I, I had a good feeling that Hunter was going to put something in the gap there. Um, I've been playing with kids since I was nine years old, and he's always clutch when it comes down to it. So um, I really had a ton of faith in him. I knew he'd at least tie it up, um, and then it was awesome. So getting that walk off right there on that one hit was awesome. What about for you this year? You're off to a hot start. Had a home run yesterday, home run today. Uh, what, what's it been like you for you to start this season on a hot streak? Uh, it's been all right. I'm just trying not to think too much, trying to play ball like I know I can, and um, really just trying to stick to the basics. So. Uh, it's amazing. I mean, uh, I can't even describe it. Uh, Steve's coming up in a huge situation like that. It was just an amazing team win all around. Yeah. 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 Talk about your outing today. You went the distance. Uh, it's a close game. You got a timely hitting from your guys. Describe how your outing went today. Uh, yeah, I just try to throw strikes and let our defense work. Uh, they're always uh, uh, outstanding on the field. I just try to throw strikes. Um, uh, yeah, and let the defense work. Um, yeah, I, I mean, I mean, even that game, the hits, uh, the defense, it was a team win, like always.